Now we do have a small campus. Um, this this building here will be our fifth building. Um, so yeah, we went from uh, from a, my office being in the closet of a one school room to, to having five buildings and uh, you know growing. So we're we're very fortunate with the opportunities, and uh, you know really look forward to helping anyone that feels like they may be in need. BusinessJournalDaily.com. Three minutes with is brought to you by Farmers National Bank. Who's the only local bank with a mobile mortgage app? Farmers. Download the app to contact your lender, calculate payments, securely scan and upload documents, and check the status of your loan. Fiercely local, fiercely loyal, Farmers. Utica Shell is one of the four uh, successful grant applications we had for the Shovel Ready uh, Appalachian Community Grant Program. Out of 40 applications, they were one of the four that were selected and um, we wanted to come to Columbia and the county and do some other visits, uh, East Palestine and visit with the Port Authority and those things, but we wanted to visit Yuka Shell while we were here and uh, hear more about all the great things that they're doing and uh, we're excited to hear their plans and we look forward to coming back when they're more fully developed. We are fortunate enough to, uh, to be the leading scorer and four were funded, so we we're very fortunate with that. And within that, we plan to expand our welding, our heavy equipment, as well as uh, our robotics programs. We're gonna build a new facility. That facility will be right next to our indoor-outdoor welding program. And it will basically give kids a, a cutting edge opportunity to learn in demand Ohio jobs uh, and, and not go into debt. And that, those are the things that we're really, really focused on is, is students leaving high school with the ability to work. Um, it hasn't seemed like that's really been a thing since the 70s and 80s. And, and we wanna get back to the fact that, you know, you don't have to go to four-year college. If it's not for you, that's okay. And if it is, it's okay also. But, you know, th there's room here in Ohio for every pathway and we wanna make them all flourish. One of the things that we want to do with this program is to uh, help improve our downtowns in Appalachia and accomplish that. and. Um, it was ready to go. So this first round it had to be a project that was planned and ready to go. And you could show Academy fit the, fit the bill for that. The grant was for 2.35 million. Uh, we plan to break ground between end of July, early August of this year. The grant will serve for students nine through 12 as a welding and heavy equipment and it will also be opened after school hours for recovery to work program. Without even statistics, there's really not many families in the area that can say they've not been impacted by the opioid uh, epidemic. And statistics show that you know, you're know 85% more likely to not relapse if you know, you're given some type of skill training and you find a meaningful job. So that's something that we're looking to partner with YSU and offer evening classes with. Now we do have a small campus. Um, this this building here will be our fifth building. Um, so yeah, we went from uh, from a, my office being in the closet of a one school room to to having five buildings and uh, you know growing. So we're we're very fortunate with the opportunities, and uh, you know really look forward to helping anyone that feels like they may be in need. BusinessJournalDaily.com. Three Minutes With is brought to you by Farmers National Bank. Who's the only local bank with a mobile mortgage app? Farmers. Download the app to contact your lender, calculate payments, securely scan and upload documents, and check the status of your loan. Fiercely local, fiercely loyal, Farmers.